Judy Varja. I wanted to jump on here real fast to give a relatively short update on my previous two resource videos for learning the Irish language. The main reason I wanted to do an update is because I recently did like a mini book haul from overseas in Ireland and I got three new books and they turned out to be some of the best books I've ever purchased and so naturally I couldn't wait to share it with y'all to see if it's something you guys would be interested in too. But before we get into the information about the new books, I wanted to quickly give an update on my online resources that I talked about in the previous video. I had mentioned the app called Drops or Language Drops, and it's a really, really, really good app. I've been using it for a while to learn some Japanese on the side, and it just drills in vocabulary from all kinds of different topics. I had also said that it would be nice if they had it for Irish, but that they did not have it for Irish at that time. But now they do. Literally just like a week ago or something, they came out with the Irish course, and I'm so excited about it. I've been doing five-minute sessions of it every day, and I really like it so far. The voice in the app that reads the words and phrases is a Munster speaker, I believe. She may be Connacht, but I'm getting Munster vibes. So if that's something you're interested in, that's just an added benefit for using drops. So far, there's actually been a couple of little typos um, I've found while playing drops, but other than that, everything runs really smooth and I'm really enjoying it. Now, so far, there aren't nearly as many topics in the Irish course as there are for some of their more mainstream uh, language courses like French and Japanese, etc. And I contacted them via Instagram of the drops company and i asked them if they will be adding more topics of words to learn in the future and they responded back to me and they said that they're hoping so but that it depends on how well the language does if it gets a lot of users and a good response then they'll be adding more topics of words to make it more of like a full course so especially for that reason, I would definitely recommend downloading the Language Drops app and using it, the Irish course, as much as possible so that they can get that feedback that, oh, wow, okay, the Irish language does have a big fan base and the people probably want more. So that hopefully they'll update their course in the future and add more words and topics to learn from. Okay, but anyway, on to the three books. They're each written by the same author, A.J. Hughes. The first book is called Lor Mor Vriera Negevaga, or The Great Irish Verb Book. And it is so thick, and it's so packed full of information on every page. It's hardcover. It doesn't even come in softcover, so you're going to get a hardcover. And it's really heavy and nice, and I like it like that. So 112 verbs in here of the most, like, commonly used Irish verbs are broken down into their full conjugations. But the super neat thing about it is that um, it takes the standard conjugation and gives the whole thing, and then it also conjugates in full the local dialectal version for all three Irish dialects of the standard verb. And sometimes that can mean slightly different um, endings placed on the verb stems, Sometimes that can mean a completely different verb stem is used in a certain dialect, and it'll show that, and I think it's super, super useful. Now, there's also 3,300 cross-referenced verbs, but they're not conjugated in full. 112 are conjugated fully. In the front of the book, there are even um, sections written in both Irish and English um, describing some unique things about the conjugation of verbs in each dialect, and that's a lot of really good information as well. So I'm very glad I got this book. Highly, highly recommend it. Full, perfect, five stars. The next book, also by the same author, A.J. Hughes, is Basic Irish Conversation and Grammar, or Bunhora Gedeka Agus Gramadach. And gold, it is pure gold. If you're learning any of the three dialects, I think this is a very useful book, but I think the thing that puts it over the top for me is that it comes with CDs where every conversation and a lot of the grammar section in the back too is narrated by native Donegal speakers. 
So if you're interested in Ulster Irish and you feel like there's like a gap in your knowledge of how to pronounce things, which is what I felt, um, then this is amazing and it'll help to fill in some of those gaps. It comes with 17 lessons. Each lesson is broken down into like mini lessons of different basic conversations. There's translations into English. There's some monologues in there. And I just think it's amazing. And then there's a really useful, concise, but thorough grammar section in the back. It's 224 pages long and also five stars. Highly, highly recommend it. The last of the three books is actually a storybook. And it's called Angelic Ola Gola, or Irish Day by Day. And it's also narrated on CDs by Donegal speakers. And each story, each of the 70 stories, gets more and more complex and difficult. But not so difficult that it's not fun anymore, but it pushes you a little each time. There are no English translations in this book, unlike in this green book. So you kind of just have to figure it out, which isn't too hard because mostly very basic Irish is used. For words that you don't know, you can easily just put it through Google Translate and or look the words up in your Irish dictionary. At the end of each story, there are 10 questions and they give you the answers to the questions right underneath. But the answers are in a mixed up jumbled order so you have to put them in the right order to correspond with the questions, which makes it challenging, but not too challenging, so it keeps it fun. These two books, they work really well separately, but they also work amazing together if you use them at the same time together. Since I've been using these, which has only been like a couple of weeks now, my vocabulary has increased, and I also feel like my sentence flexibility has also increased, which is something that I was looking for which was really important to me. But anyway, those were the three books. And of course, I wanted to fill you all in about the Drops app too while I was at it. I will have all these items and the Drops app linked below. I'll also link the home pages to several other online Irish bookshops. So in case the link I've provided is out of stock of a certain book, or if you just like to compare prices and shipping or whatnot, you can search for the books on those websites. So thank you again for watching. I'll be back before long with more Irish content. I probably won't do another real or like full length video until sometime after my birthday, which is in a little bit less than a week from now. So maybe sometime in like early April, I'll do another full length video. But until then, Lan Oravig Folum, Agaslan Gavol. Bye.